Hi right, guys, here we are. Welcome to IPA. We're on another investigation. This time we're we're going towards the the Gracedew Priory, which is an old nunnery from dating right back to the 12th century. Um, say hello to my partner. Hi guys. So we're starting off here at the at the Great Saint Great Central, the Blue Bell Line. Charmwood Forest Railway Viaduct. Starting here first, and then we're going to make our way over to the ruins and see what we can get. But we've been there twice before on Halloween. There's too many people there, so we didn't get very good results. And the first time we went, we went with uh, um, another paranormal group, Afterlife. Afterlife. So we didn't get much there either. So we're going to try again this time and see what we can get. So we'll start off here at the viaduct. And then we'll see uh, what we get at the, the ruins. So sit back, get yourself a cup of calf and enjoy the show. What we see, you see. Oh. I think you like doing it yourself. Do you think you do? No, I don't feel me. Is there anything you want to add? No, I'm fine. Great. I'm just waiting to see spirits. <laughs> okay. Right, stay tuned. Stay close. Is that where the water runs Yeah, it's where the water runs down. Here you can see how big. I'm still convinced this place ain't haunted. Well, I'm, I'm not convinced. sensing anything I'm here. Not or it is either. I just heard rumours over the years, it's probably just stories that people used to hang themselves on. They used to call it the hanging bridge, but I don't believe it. No, no, there's never any evidence of anything. You show yourself, any spirits here want to come forward and communicate with us? Now is your chance to. Come forward and tell us your story. Any navvies that died building this railway? Want to come forward and tell us what happened? Okay, right, we'll move on a bit more. Bert. Bert. Who's Bert? Hello. Does Bert here want to communicate with us? Some will say the woods surrounding the um, the ruins are also haunted, but I've been here before and I've never picked up or felt anything. Cursed. Cursed. I'm using a Spirit Talk or Paranormal Research Device app. This is what the words are coming upon. Don't know how accurate these apps are, so I'm trying them out wherever we are. See what results we get from them. You know, I've just come out of the wood part onto the main footpath. Apparently this area is rumoured to have um, sort of a monk um, spirit that resides in this area. But I'm saying it's only a story. I don't know how true it is. Marjorie. Marjorie. Mm -hmm. Marjorie who? Name I've just got. Try the necrophony when we get there. Around down the statue. There. Yeah, stop off point to the nun statue.
still went through there once, didn't they? The stepping stone all yeah. got further up. Who was she? Yeah, I don't know. Some... Right, here we are, we've just arrived at the ruins, we're just going to have a, a walk around first and then we'll do some uh, few little experiments and some baseline um, EMFs and whatnot. So, sit tight and enjoy the show. <laughs> spirits that may reside here or are grounded here what we ask is you to come forward and try and communicate with us and tell us your story who you was my name's Dave and that's Donna over there my partner we've introduced ourselves meaning you no harm no disrespect to this place or to any spirits. What we want to do is to communicate, find out who's here still, resides here. So if you're able to, we ask you to come forward and try any means necessary to communicate with us, if you're able to. spot any orbs because there's a lot of flying insects. This is trouble when you're outside, you've got the problem of flying insects and when you're indoors you've got the problem of dust orbs. I think the original cemetery is over that way a bit more, a bit further over there. Not quite sure. On the old map it tells you what each area was. Because you've got a red on it. Oh, 
Right there. Anyway, it gets really dark when you need it. Get a bit closer. Put the infrared on, right, and then turn the flash off and see if that makes a difference. Probably because you've got the flash integrating with the infrared. I hear this place is supposed to be haunted, is that true? Monks and nuns and whatever you were. Them spirits here, you should come forward, try and show yourself to us. You can use our energy to help you. I know there's lots of people been here over time disturbing you. We're not here to ruin any parts of the building or disrespect you. All we want to do is to communicate and find out who's is still residing here. So if you're able to, can you come forward and show yourself to me? Come forward. It's very warm out here tonight. It's very warm tonight. I'm going to put a few things down. EMS and whatnot. Come forward, spirits, if you're able to. All I ask is you to come forward and show yourselves if you're able to. Use our spirits to help. Use our energy. Energy, you know, as our spirit guides as well. Close my eyes and use our energy or channel through us or with us.
forward and blow something up so we know you're here. Can you just move yourself a minute? Do you me? Yeah. What? Right behind you, I'm, I thought I've picked, got like a figure over behind you. What? Just sit when I was sat there? No, right behind you now. Oh. Right here. It's probably like that. I don't know, it could be, it could be the, the brickwork. Come here a minute. No, it's still there. Oh. I think it's the matrix in pitch, you know, the... Mm. Where? <laughs> it looks like a figure. What do you mean? Yeah, that's a person. See the orb just fly past. No, it was a fly. Oh. I that's what I said, there's a lot of flies Let here. Let me see if the SLS will work. Do you think it will? Yeah. I don't know whether it's the pattern in the big work. You can clearly see there's a figure standing right there. Mm. See his face? Black legs. This doesn't work, does it? Yes, it does. No, you're not going to get that. Unless, like unless you get close right up to it, then use the torch. Torch don't work because I've got the SLS on. <laughs> oh no, it's useless. The thing is, it's you a lot, a lot, a lot smaller than what that image is. Yeah. It's still there. That's bizarre. Uh, I think it's the, I think it's the pattern in the brickwork. Yeah. Is there a man there? Yeah, it's the pattern in the brickwork. I can see it a bit closely now. I've debunked that. Four spirits if you're able to.
me. It's an ectophonic. Spirits here, come forward and try and communicate with me if you're able to. Come forward, spirits, trying to communicate with us. Come forward. bits of ruins over here.
move this millimeter. I'm move it. So I'm going to move this over here. Set it. Okay. Right. It's so peaceful. Huh? So peaceful. So that's sat down there. I don't, um, I don't trust this. So, so how do you mean passes through that way? Hmm? I don't trust this thing. Oh. Not anything. I don't really, but. I've not, I've no cat balls go off, no flashes, no one spins me, no wall. Lost it. I'm convinced this is still not working. I think it's all stored. I think it's all stored. Do you get a feeling in the walls? Oh yeah. When you walk through that, especially down near that third bridge. See, it's made. It's, see, it's picture matrix in there. I mean, there's like it looks like there's a figure there as well, but it's not. It's the wall. Pattern of the wall. Yeah. It's uh, there's a lot of hexagon ones. Yeah, it's a bit too just a tech. Oh, that needs charging to the dive. Who's that? Well, it's in the pocket. You only have that, and you put that in there. Yeah, the hex comes out. Oh, the, uh, you got the EMF. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. It's all just random stuff, I think. That's it. It's all random. Try cat balls in this location. Further up. That's common death. Oh, I bet it's running out of power. Mind you, send me charge ones. Have you tried EVP?
see this is this this Breezy Priory is supposed to be one of the most haunted spots in Leicestershire, but I'm beginning to believe that it isn't. It might just unless it's one of those days where nothing wants to cooperate. Could it be nothing wants to cooperate? <laughs> Thank you. Can you do that again? Can you flash that ball again for me? Let me put this snow meter down here. Hello. Drop to communicate with us. Drop to flash that ball. To flash that ball again. If you're able to, can you flash that ball again for me? Do one more last time. Doesn't matter about that thing I placed next to it. That will flash all different colours if you touch it. it. Will not harm you. Can you try and touch it for me? This little black box. Well, that ball again. Oh, thank you. There you go. Thanks, Thank you. Sometimes it's best not to have it better. There you go. Thank you. Can you touch that black box next to me with the green light on it? Make it flash all different colours for me. That would be fantastic if you could do that. We can use our energy to help. Can you try that for me, please? Could you flash that ball again, please? Brilliant, thank you. Thank you. Could you do it again? Dave. <laughs> if you like me that much, can you touch that black box on the floor next to it with the green light on and the red face? If you touch it for me, that'd be fantastic. That will that will let us know that you're really here. Oh damn it. I pressed forward when I saw the orb. Did you see it? Yeah, I don't know, it's quite it's difficult. It's difficult in this to determine if uh, it's definitely an orb because it was slow going and it zoomed right up to me. Could you go back, please, Spirit, and touch that ball? Okay, we'll go over here. I might be a bit afraid of us. Okay, that's the ball. There you go. Now, can you touch that black box on the floor for me next to it? Make it flash all different colours. That's nice. Can you do that for me? It might make a little noise as well. Can you do that for me? If you can, flash the ball again. Cut forward, spirit. Could you light up that ball again? Can you touch the box for me on the floor next to it, the black one? Yes. Can you try it then for me? Make it make the different colours flash. Try touching the box with the green light. It'll flash lots of different colours, but it will not hurt you at all. It will just be the same as the ball. 
Can you touch that box for me, the black one on the floor next to the ball? It's got a little green light on it. Do you like us here? Again. Can you please touch that black box on the floor for me with the green light on? I promise you it will not hurt you. It will just make funny noise just and flash deep. different colours. Can you touch it for me? Can you touch it for me? Nice the ball better. Yeah. Try over there in the rooms. Yeah. Back of kit. Just try next to the chimney. Right, we'll move location a bit further up where the big chimney stack is. There's some cat balls in there and the over there where you see that little bed over there, over there is the millimeter. So we'll just sit back and uh, just wait a minute. Let's see. If there are spirits residing in this place, can you come forward and show yourself to us please? If you're able to. around this old cooker or fireplace is it? Yeah. There's a couple of cat ball, cat ball gadgets in there. Could you please touch them? They only glow up, so don't hurt your anything. Can you come forward and show yourself to us, please? Are there any spirits here in this big fireplace? If so, could you touch any of those cat balls that are in there? Or the one over there? Maybe the man that was behind us is coming down to do it. You come forward, spirits. Come forward spirits if you're here, please show yourselves to us, you make yourself known to us if you're able to, try and communicate with us. Oh, 
anyone wish to come forward to cooperate? We must be done. Would you like to communicate with us? If you could come forward to this big fireplace. Like the chimneys up there. The chimneys at the top. Yeah. Come forward to this big fireplace, any spirit at all. There's some kind of like an object which we call a ball, cat ball. It's a round thing. And all you have to do is just touch it. Just so we know you're here, it will just flash its lovely colour. Right, move to another location within these ruins. So just have to see what people be here. If there's any spirits present in this place, we ask you to come forward and try and show yourself to us, if you're able to. Use our energy to help you. Paratech by API Droid. Started scanning. Madeline. Light up those balls, please. Warrant. Any here? Yes. Balls here? Um, there's three in the wall. They're here? No. Three just there. Yeah, I wonder what it was. Disrespectful. I don't know.
here. Well that wraps it up here at the ruins, uh, now we're going to go through the woods and do a little bit in the woods and see what we pick up there. Yeah. Stay tuned. Are there any spirits present in this wood, in this forest, this wood, I should come forward, show yourself to us. <laughs> 